And that is just a taste of the Merritt Theater Company's latest work. The show is called A Long Way Off. It's making a regional premiere starting this weekend. And here to tell us more about the show, actors Rachel Scardina and Carter Perry. Guys, thanks for being here this morning. Thanks for having us. I, I, I was just saying a couple of different things, really. I don't I don't know Merritt Theater. I don't know the company very well, and I don't know the show very well. So, so let's start with the theater company itself. Have you guys ever been involved with Merritt Theater before? I have. This is Rachel's first time mm -hmm. with, okay. the sh with the company. Yeah. So they're based out of northern Kentucky. And it's um, a, a four-year-old Christian uh, theater company. Yeah. And uh, so this is their fourth or fifth show that they've done in the last three years. Awesome. So still pretty new. And I had heard that, though, based in northern Kentucky, the shows are actually out in Anderson? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Anderson Center. Okay, yes. great. Awesome. Awesome. Well, Rachel, tell me about the show. So uh, it's a reframing of the story of the prodigal son okay. uh, set in uh, 1930 in Iowa in the midst of the Great Depression. Okay. And my character, Hannah, at the beginning of the story gets engaged and you find out that several years before her brother Hunter left home uh, with half of his inheritance and uh, set out on his own. And so it's her job to go and find him and bring him home for the wedding. When you guys have a show like this, and I, and I don't know if it's one you were familiar with or not, but when you hear the words regional premiere, it certainly sounds very fresh and very new. Mm -hmm. Is that is that more fun to be involved with something that many people don't know about? Maybe you didn't really know much about either coming into it? It is. It may, it, it, it's very exciting. Yeah. Um, being that it is a newer show, but it has such a, a, a fresh perspective on the parable of the prodigal son. Yeah. Basically taking that and putting it into some of the events that happened in the 20s and early 30s with the Great Depression and, and everything. So uh, it's a lot of fun. It's very energetic and it's hilarious. <laughs> really hilarious too. Yeah. Okay, so it's some cool. comic elements in that. Okay. Beautiful, okay. beautiful comic relief in, in the show like all great shows have. Yeah. And so that's been a lot of fun to get to play with those to make it, take the word and make it flesh, yeah. really. Um, it, it's really brought it to life here in the last few weeks, especially. How important is that element of what Merit Theater does, the, 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 the Christian perspective, important to you as, as, as a performer that you wanted to be involved with a show that's that meaningful? Hmm. I think the elements of community, yeah. uh, Merit really strives to uh, make our whole our whole cast, our whole crew, a community, and yeah. that's what I found um, in Hunter and Hannah and the the characters in the show, as well as the actors and all the crew members. Yeah. So you guys are in the middle of Tech Week. I know it's hectic and crazy, <laughs> and you're thinking, "Oh my gosh, is it ever going to come together?" And all those kinds of things. But have you had any folks come in? Have you had any sort of test audiences yet, or anybody who's come to watch? And what kind of reaction have you gotten so far? Yeah, we've had we've had um, small audiences the last couple of nights, okay. sitting yeah. in, sitting in the back. Um, they haven't really given us as much feedback as I'm sure they have the directors, but sure. um, we we, did, we have had a couple of friends come and they came up afterwards and they they said that they really loved the music especially okay. and uh, and the storyline kind of kind of like how how it progresses like she said from the beginning and then when you get into Act Two what happens yeah that whole thing so uh, that's been great feedback to receive from them. Mm -hmm. So ticket wise, do people do we order them online? Do we do we go to the box office there at the Anderson Center? Talk to me about how folks can come see the show. Yeah, so you can go on our website, Merit Theater's website, and you can buy tickets there. You can also, they have the box office number on there as well. Okay. Also, all of social media, Merit Theater, um, is available there as well. Excellent. Well, break a leg, guys. Really, really appreciate Thank you coming you. in and telling me more, not only about the show, but about the theater company itself, which is not one that I knew a whole lot about. All right. <laughs> it is a 